tomorrow. You're tired, but you have to keep going. There's still more. There's always more to do. It's not going to be easy. I want to tell you a story about a god of the Northmen called Baldur. The second son of Odin, he was beautiful, good and wise. He was fair of feature, he spoke fair words, he gave fair judgments. Light shone from him, only good things were told of him. Yet he was the first of the gods to die. Is broken. There's no way you can fix it. What do you do now, Sen? Northmen tell this story about the death of Baldur. It begins with dark dreams. Night after night, Baldur dreams of his own death. The gods fear for his life. So Baldur's mother makes everything in the world fire, wood, iron, stone, earth, wood, beasts, birds, serpents, poison, sickness. Swear. She can't open the gate. It's locked. Try harder. She can't. She will. She'll find a way. She always finds a way.
through it. It's dangerous. Follow it. What's behind the gate? Where will it take you? It's not safe. Dillian, there he is. There he is. What are you waiting for? Quick, find a way. Find him. Go through him before he disappears. Dillian, don't lose him. Away to where is he? Where's he gone? We're in the wrong world. He's not here. She's in the wrong world. He's not in this world. He's in the other one. He's in the other one. He's in the dark world. The dark. The dark world. The world once seemed so simple. Black and white. Darkness and light. Narrow dividing lines of our own making. Dillian taught her to see further. To peek through the cracks and see the worlds of color stretching away from the gloom. And Senno explored new paths into the unknown. But Loki shapes himself into a woman and asks Baldur's mother, Is it really true that all things promise to keep him safe? I did not ask the mistletoe. Baldur's mother confesses. I thought it was too young. Oh dear. Senwa, you've got it. Why isn't he here? You can't go up you there. You can't go up there. Not in this world. Stroked your hair. Do you remember the way you felt? He saved you. He saved you. That's you. You own him. His love keeps you strong. He saw who she could be. He saw who she really was. He saw the warrior with him. way up there. She can do this. You're nearly there. She, she can find the way. Was it worth it? You broke it. You killed You couldn't see the darkness within you. Loki makes a dart out of mistletoe. 
and goes to the gods as they throw things at Baldur. The blind god, Huth, was there. Loki asks him why he wasn't taking pollen. Huth says, I cannot see where Baldur stands, and even if I could see him, I have no weapon. You are guilty. Loki replies, Years had passed since she left her father. She trained hard alongside her friend, Dillian. She saw things no one else could. Patterns, shapes, movement. An intuition that made her an exceptional warrior. Friendship turned to love. But the shadow of darkness never let her go. And she was caught between two worlds. That of Zimbel and her past. A future. Two realities tearing at her soul. He didn't believe that she was cursed. He saved you when everyone else turned their backs. He was the only one that really loved her. He did love her. Dillian's in the tower. He saw that she was strong. how the gods mourned Baldur. His body was to be burnt by his ship, but they could not manage to push it into the sea and sent the giantess to do it. She comes riding a wolf and has vipers for her reins. She pushes Baldur's ship into the sea with such force that the ground shakes and the rollers burst into flames. When Baldur's wife sees his body carried onto the ship, her heart bursts with grief and she dies. She's put next to her husband, and the pyre is lit, sending the dead to hell. But even so, the gods cannot accept his death.
didn't she listen to her father? She thought she could defy her. Because he believed in you. Father cannot understand your darkness. He cannot see through your eyes. No one can. <laughs> My own father was born blind. He doesn't have the faintest idea of what the night looks like. <laughs> the word dark to him means as little as the word light. So someone is afraid of the dark. So we fix them by taking away their sight. You give up the beautiful world thing. You, and only you can see just to be rid of your nightmares. Or is this the blood she paid? What if this is What if you're now? wrong? What if this has nothing to do with the sword? What if we're wrong? The sword will never... The gift that makes you so special in my life. <laughs> what if this... Is the end? Just it's just a trick. It's just a pointless test. You've been fooled before. You could be fooled again. You're being tested. I'm not told the world's to protect just their you game from for you. You never know which way it's going to go. Because <laughs> <laughs> But it made it worse. 
I'm so sorry.